The new Rantoul Sports Complex is getting ready for its opening weekend. That's when hundreds of people are expected to turn out. Fox Illinois' Evan Hensley is working for you, and he joins us with the progress on the facility and the impact it could have on the Rantoul community. Evan? The Rantoul Family Sports Complex will host nearly 60 baseball and softball teams this weekend for tournaments as it shows off the new facility. The county's tourism industry says that this is the exact kind of kind of pick me up that local businesses have needed. Everyone's so excited to finally get out here and play and get on these fields. It's been a long time coming and us as a village here in Rantoul and the community is just really excited to start hosting some people out here. Renee Wilson with the Rantoul Family Sports Complex says that good weather looks like it could be on the way for opening weekend. The new facility and its eight new fields will welcome 57 teams to the village starting Friday. And with the tournaments comes a financial impact that is needed by businesses while still in the pandemic. It's the uh, industries that have been hurt uh, by COVID. Uh, so those would be all your hospitality industries of hotels and restaurants and uh, gas stations. And We have every weekend booked um, throughout the rest of October starting this weekend. And so the fact that they know that there's going to be so many visitors coming into town, that's going to be a direct impact to them and, and bring them more revenues. Mike Kuhn with Visit Champaign County says the projections are in the millions when it comes to the financial impact, and it is expected to help bring more businesses to the village of Rantoul. Having the complex there will we'll draw some more uh, hotel properties there, but even so, uh, many of those teams will be staying in Champaign. The main fields are finished with more work to be done. Wilson is confident the final project will be something to marvel when it's finished by the end of May. Uh, we still have a couple fields left to turf and get our concessions up and running and obviously get the rest of the roads paved. But all the big things that needed to be done to get us ready for this weekend are done. And we're just, like I said, we're really excited to have people finally here. And, and the complex is booked for months to come, which Wilson says will help keep small and locally owned businesses going despite the current pandemic. And that this progress could significantly help the village in the long term with a potential economic boom. Reporting in studio, Evan Hensley, back to you. Thank you, 